Good evening everyone. Uh, tonight I'm going to show you a quick tip on how to do um, a knockout using SCAL 5. It's just a program that I've bought recently and uh, one that I'm thoroughly enjoying. So I've done um, the main initial in Cooper Black and I've done uh, the name just in a, um, I think I've done it in Fredly Alternates bold font. So I'm just going to make sure that this is actually um, on top. So I'm going to click Arrange and then bring to front, just so that this is on the front when I move it over. Now I'm going to turn this one a little bit because I think I want to do something a little bit different with this one and just do something fun with it. I think that looks good. Let's try to... There we go. So let's just pretend this is what I'm doing. Okay. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to make a copy of this and I'm going to paste it off to the side just because I'm going to use this when this has been cut out and knocked out. Okay. Um, let's bring this down just out of the way so we don't have to look at it. So we're going to uh, select all. We're going to go up to effects and we're going to hit knockout. And this is where you can choose a gap if you choose to have an extra gap around or if you don't want a gap around the letters just um, hit OK and that's it. I do like a gap so I'm going to put it to 10. I'm going to click preview just so I can see how much is around them. I like that look and I'm going to hit OK and we're done. We can remove this and delete it and then we can bring our original back in or the copy of one back in place it in there so you can see how easy that is and I'm just going to select both and then I'll hit file I'll click export and I'll export it as an SVG so that I can use it in any of my software programs uh, for cutting for my cutters Cricut Silhouette uh, my big plotter um, as long as it's an SVG file we're good to go that's how easy it is to do knockout um, with SCAL 5 and I'll tell you it's such a fun program to use I've been having a lot of fun with it I'm gonna start doing more tutorials using it um, just so you can see um, how easy it really is anyways hope you enjoyed this one happy crafting and have a kick-ass night bye